All right, so we are a uh, day removed from the, the Mayo visit. So, you know, looking back at the last four months, uh, you know, we, we stopped the progression of cancer. So you have to you know, really focus on some of the accomplishments and think about where we're at right now and what's the path forward. So I consider the last four months uh, transformational in my life from a physical, spiritual, uh, you know, in, in some ways, I transformed my business too in the process where I uh, developed a whole new zest for uh, what I do in business. I developed a whole new appreciation for uh, everyone around me. I've implemented a life, lifestyle changes that will, that can serve everybody, you know, who's, who's paying attention. That's my belief. So uh, this was about making a goal line stand and now we're going to go on offense. So uh, those, those lifestyle changes, I needed to stop destroying my body, stop beating myself up, stop, uh, you know, mentally, physically, emotionally, the, the foods, the alcohol, the things I was putting in my body the last life, you know, but really, you know, when it comes to alcohol the last 25, 26, 27 years, I, you know, just, just beating, beating my body up. And then also, you know, there's some other things I've learned too, you know, the, you know, immune boosters, the anti-inflammatory things about hydrogen peroxide. And sorry, I'm holding my phone with my hand because I can't find my stand. The kids, um, just say my five and a half year olds, as they would say, are they 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 have a vendetta to pretty much destroy everything I own. Uh, anyway, so um, and speaking of, I want to show you this. Uh, every Father's Day, my wife has uh, since the kids were uh, basically six months old has done this picture with the boys on my bus bench one of my bus benches here in Minneapolis so anyway I, you guys probably see that in a lot of videos in the background but that's what it is so the it's time to let go on offense what does that mean well I'm gonna look in the Rife machine I'm going to uh get some more genetic testing done I, there might be some trips in the near future well let me, let me rephrase it there's gonna be uh, a trip to California to um meet with uh, integrative medicine practitioner. There's a, a company here. I will tell you the name, Connors Clinic. They are in Lake Elmo, Minnesota. Connors Clinic, they do you know uh, treatments with nutritional supplements. Uh, and I'm, I'm oversimplifying what they do. Uh, Kevin Connors, the founder of the clinic, does uh, work with the Rife machine. I did a video on the Royal Raymond Rife and the Rife machine and, and its potential to help um, to help overcome the disease, which is cancer and many other things too. So I, I, I invite you to check them out, the Connors Clinic. And then, um, you know, I've got uh, Dr. Lucy Bluen in Montreal is going to help me out with uh, some, some treatment options, which I will detail uh, in the future. Uh, there's a clinic in Germany. We might be visiting. I might be visiting the Charlie uh, Foundation. I believe they're in Florida. And, oh, I think Florida. Anyway, so I don't want to give misinformation here. But that's just a, that's a sampling. Uh, Germany, Mexico, Canada uh, might uh, you know, at some point do a, a trip up to Montreal. So anyway, that's what we're doing in, in a nutshell. Tons more coming. Uh, like I said, we made the goal line stand. We, uh, I don't know if you guys are football fans, but think of Ernest Biner for the Cleveland Browns uh, fumbling on like the two or three yard line and the Denver Broncos recovering. And then that's when John Elway uh, cemented himself in immortality when he went on the drive to, uh, to win the ball game in the playoffs. And I believe they advanced to the Super Bowl uh, after that, but Google it, Ernest Biner fumbling on like the two yard line. It's like one of the greatest 
disappointments in football history if you're a, and, and probably the greatest if you're a Cleveland Browns fan. That and the, you know, the, the, the hiring of uh, Hugh Jackson. So anyway, um, that's what we got cooking. I will keep you posted. Everyone keep trucking. Make every second count. You don't know when it's last. Let's roll. Boom!